all right first download paint.net then download mod studio 2 and then search this on google and then download those templates once you're done downloading and installing those apps as well as extracting those templates uh, you can simply come to your paint.net and then create your work and stuff like that so in this video right here i was busy with the other project that i was doing uh, what is coming called time tracking uh, limited so this uh, tutorial i'm just gonna show you with the this guy's company uh, virtual virtual uh, company truck so they on the skin initials you just write in the small caps and then the skin name intercool then price 56 then unlock level one then click on the icon image if you don't have that you can simply put on default so man i'm not just gonna hit on uh, the dg logo <coughs> and then the image is where the the nonsense will happen so now uh you get a uh, template such as a trailer templates or the tankers so with this one i've just uh this is the curtain slider uh, 136 feet long as you can see there i was busy with it so one, once you're done with your work you just delete the background and then same here with uh, this one this is your 78 the, the, the small trailer the same process you delete the background once you're done with your project and then you want to save it as a png or you can save it as a DDS, but I'll save it as a PNG. I'll just write underscore enter and hit save. Click OK. Uh, same as this one. Uh, save curtain slide along underscore enter. Then hit save and click OK all right so i didn't I save it okay oh, this is weird okay close this one and then close that one so back to our mod studio 2 project so here's what i usually do on the top uh portfolio or folder or file I just click on the 78s only uh, 78 curtain slider the drive in the drive in slider the insulated slide the moving floor and the refrigerated uh, refrigerated slide yeah all the 78s so i'm gonna go with that the small trailer yeah they will stay on the 78s only then on the bottom one of this uh, profile, I'm just going to click only the 30, 136. And there you can see the, the picture there. It will show you the guidelines. All the 136 refrigerated, the moving floor, drive van, and so on. Click on that paint job. And there we go. So the 78s will, will stay on top. All the 78s and then the the curtain that the 136 will be on the bottom like i did here on this video as you can see all the 78s 78 moving floor and double b 74 yeah refrigerated all of them will be on the top and then 136 on the bottom <clears throat> like i did here so once you're done with the, that uh, 
because we can save your remote and then go for testing so with the accessories you can just leave it like that image icon and check everything is okay there make sure that click on SAS box trailer and then we save it as a, a project that I'm busy with uh, right now so I'm gonna export the mod <coughs> Uh, it should take some time, but I'm going to skip this part. Okay, once the mod is uh, finished and exported, you know the procedure. Download uh, documents, Eurotruck Simulator, and then MOD fold and then place it there. Then mod manager then confirm your mod <clears throat> and then we activate it so let's see how it looks like in the game uh inter 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 where are you where are you eh. okay nope not you there we go <clears throat> let's see how it looks like very beautiful hmm? nice clean smart <laughs> yeah so that's how it is folks that's how you uh combine these these uh trailers on your uh, paint shop your mod studio 2 project so remember the 78 will be at the top and then 136 at the bottom so I'm gonna show you with the curtain slider trailer. The thing that I was talking about the earlier on. <coughs> uh, wait, there we go. So this is the 136 feet long. And then that's your one uh, 78 uh, trailer, the small one. Click on double. Click on HTC, HCT, uh, double again, double B, sorry. And yeah. Then the single one. Yeah, so that's how it is, guys. That's how you combine the, the pro, your paint job project. So, hope this video helped you in your journey of making skins. That's bonk.